Okay, hi, greeting student. Uh, welcome back. Today we are going to learn chapter 8 about radioactivity. So what does it mean by radioactivity? Okay, when was radioactive first discovered, when was atom and so on. Radioactivity. So, we can see that we can see that the sun has the radio, the largest radioactive source to the earth. In terms of radioactive, uh, we can say in terms of the light, okay, the light that is shined to the earth. Okay, sun rays are normal and do not contain radioactive radiation. Due to this, the sun is considered a safe radioactive source because no radioactive radiation is released. So basically, is this true? Is this fact true? Then they gather data about a corona mass injection of the sun in 6 September in the Australian Telescope. For me, show that the sun ray contain gamma ray. For first, they say don't have ma. Then in 2017, they, they, they study the sun and they, they study the sun called gamma ray. So gamma ray is not healthy for the body. Gamma ray can kill uh, it's to kill cell actually. To, for example, gamma ray is used now in hospital to kill cancer cell. Means if you, if you got cancer, you will take the gamma ray and it's like a laser la, te, 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 and hui hen tong, ji liu la, something like that, hui hen tong. Why? It will be very painful when you do radio isotope. Why? Because when the laser kill the cell, kill the bad cell, ah, put out the si bao, the laser also will kill the good cell. How the cell can put out the cell? Each can take the last. So the person that usually go undergo cancer therapy is, will be very pain. Ah, you cancer stage three, stage four, like what? You will, ah, you, ah, if you do also, if you do also, you will die. Usually, you will die lah because you got cancer. You do also, you die because the laser will kill good cell and bad cell. Your whatever good cell also die. If you don't do also you die because your the cancer cell will continue to spread when you are in stage four. So so like like that lah, huh? So make make sure keep yourself healthy, don't uh don't uh take don't don't get cancer. Uh. Nowadays more and more people are getting cancer. Eat more vegetable, more fruit, don't eat too much McDonald's and KFC as and the, all the whatever fried thing lah. Fried things uh, don't don't eat so much. Because uh, when you grow up, then you got, and then you regret whole hoi, but too late already, too late. So now you are young, take care of your health, um, eat more vegetable and fruit, don't eat so much of fried thing, exercise and sleep well. The UV umbrella show the photograph below used to block the ultraviolet rays from the sun ray. Can the UV light protect the body from the gamma ray? Suggest one material to make umbrella to able to block gamma ray. Is the material practical? Explain your answer. So, um, a, a lot of questions they ask here. Uh, but maybe we can go through a few questions before we understand what is radioactive uh, ray. So at first we know that, we already know that gamma ray is not healthy. Well, gamma ray is for example, for the hospital to do to kill the cancer cell, gamma ray also come from the sun, especially during noon twelve o'clock, because if you morning you go exercise morning ah the where the sun is maybe seven or eight o'clock is okay is it's not only okay it's good for your health because the sun will give your skin vitamin okay will give you vitamin D and it is uh healthy for you when you morning and you 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 got vitamin D from your um from the sun but during afternoon uh, 12 o'clock uh, especially in Malaysia uh, and actually around the world some more the same uh, 12 o'clock 1 o'clock 2 o'clock where the sun is above you and it is very hot then it got gamma ray so gamma ray is not good gamma ray will cause cancer um cancer skin cancer for example if you want skin cancer every day 12 o'clock you stand outside until one o'clock then you you get skin cancer um i don't know lah maybe the some people don't get but but don't do that lah huh? first you get skin cancer or you will get cataract cataract means uh the eye ah, ngan mok ah, something like that you cannot see 
it will got the white color and then you cannot see especially for animal also la. especially for auntie uncle that don't take care of their eye why because when they drive their car always drive car don't want to wear sunglasses 不要戴黑眼睛啊驾车的时候就戴这样的眼睛 and then the, a lot of car 会反光嘛, a lot of the car mirror so when you drive drive especially KL people of slang or maybe Sremban 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 you you drive 10 minutes risk by KL or slang or you drive means one hour ma. and then when you drive out your eye need to add that drive highway then it is not good when your eyes like that it means too much light is into your eye and then at, at last the uncle auntie will got cataract and then need to go to operation la, do operation usually okay one la, operation but no need lah huh? next time if your daddy mommy uh, drive car if the sun is hot make sure your parent wear the sunglasses okay so that to protect their eye and and uh, the uv light is really not good if you make wrinkle you know wrinkle are chao pei so if you want to become pretty and model like a model don't always 12 o'clock 1 o'clock 2 o'clock chi sai tai yang 1 o'clock 2 o'clock stand under the sun then you will get old faster then you become not beautiful already because you get old faster also due to the sun that's why you see all the the girl model girl that very they know how to take care uh, they will um 12 o'clock don't want to go outside uh, because it's hot even if go outside a little bit also they will want to take the umbrella because you need to protect your skin the tv umbrella show the photograph show to block the ultraviolet ray can the uv umbrella block actually i don't think so i haven't googled this but roughly no how to block gamma ray okay for example we can see here at page what is this page page 241 how to block gamma ray gamma ray is this one gamma ray ionizing power is very high so uh, uh, it's a Y, uh, the symbol Y, gamma. To block it, you need lead 10 cm thick. You, lead, uh, you know lead. Uh. Lead 10 cm thick or 1 meter thick of concrete. 就是一个 meter. The, here they didn't write. Uh, okay? Either 10 cm thick of lead or 1 meter. 1 meter is, I, I cannot, 1 meter is bigger than my hand, you know. Of concrete, you know concrete, uh, the stone, this wall one thick very thick stone only you can block the gamma ray so eventually actually your sun cannot block the gamma ray i, I mean the umbrella ray, um, cannot block the gamma ray because you need either you make this umbrella with a lead 10 cm or you put the umbrella one meter thick concrete means you take the stone uh, you take the very very big stone put on top of you then you get the umbrella the stone very big stone then you you hold the big stone uh, then then you protect yourself from the gamma ray one meter of concrete but you uh, this this likely won't happen that's why i say stay inside the house during afternoon noon hot time not only stay under the sun, actually depend on your actually my room also not good and sometimes it's not good to buy house when you stay upstairs like my one is terrace house so my roof is tiles tiles is actually very thin so eventually this is the tiles uh, the, the, the sun will still go in because it's gamma ray so it's, it's not healthy so never mind lah huh? no money to buy I think the best is you buy terrace house during the you need to ground floor. Now I'm second floor. Ma. You go ground floor, then you got this concrete to block the sunlight. So it is a lot more healthy. And then let's say there is a condominium of 10 floor. Don't buy the top one. Usually I like to buy the second, uh, second or third top. So that at least you got the. Uh, you can block the gamma ray instead of tiles. Usually the most top floor is the tiles, right? So you cannot block and zinc roof or her cannot block uh, when you are inside the car also cannot block that's why when you sit inside the car when you go back to penang then suddenly you go get sick hey, why why you get sick also i drink water ah 
car got aircon ah, but because it's known hot, the sun rays still penetrate your roof and it affect you and uh, then you get sick. It's not healthy also. So can the UV umbrella protect? Uh, maybe by a little bit or depend on how many percent I didn't search this one, but there will be a certain percentage. Something better than nothing lah. Of course, you take umbrella is better than uh, 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 nothing. Suggest one material to able to block the gamma ray. Lead. You want to use lead to lead umbrella? I don't know. You know lead lah. Lead is like the pencil lead lah. The, you use the pencil lead. Uh, the, the, the density is high lah. That's why you can write high density. And yeah so is it practical i don't know maybe in the future god so so far don't have lah huh? hmm. it's tip tip but but this is a very good marketing eh? uv protection even though it don't have really like uv protection but it say uv protection umbrella that can block ultraviolet ray wow i mean it's a very good marketing ah you do business ah so you put this one people thought well i can block but is the same one la. unless uh, I don't know la. I didn't google this one la, but yeah, I want to put UV UV protection umbrella or what actually is the is the I, I'm not sure I haven't searched it but I think it's the same because you cannot block gamma ray unless you take one meter thick of concrete or 10 cm of lead okay so what is radioactivity radioactivity is you see here gone not Okay, what is radioactivity? The next page, uh, page 2, 3, 4. Radioactivity is a random and spontaneous decay of a process of unstable nucleus by emitting radioactive radiation as shown in figure 8.2. So, radioactive is a spontaneous decay of unstable nucleus by emitting radioactive radiation. Means it's a something like atom that is unstable and it will emit radiation means something like atom it will emit the radiation unstable and emit radiation uh, radiation for example a lot uh, a few for example uh, I say uh, gamma ray for example gamma ray it's a something that produce radiation and it produce a lot of uh, it also produce energy produce energy so we can see for example we cannot see here here didn't say it, it is something um, unstable so radioactivity is happening especially in the Sun where there is nuclear fusion because if you go to the Sun I always like to ask my student like if you go to the Sun then I will ask my student like there is no oxygen how the fire can burn okay so I always like to ask my student Sun got oxygen or not usually they will say no la. they will ask if Sun no oxygen then why got fire fire to burn because you, you need oxygen to burn then you then some student will say god got oxygen then i say how how got oxygen no tree or no tree how to produce oxygen then they'll be like twink, twink, twink. okay because in the sun also a lot of radioactivity that is happening in the sun where we won't be learning here but we learn little bit like where the where that is the combination of two hydrogen atom to become helium like nuclear la. just imagine nuclear explosion pausa nuclear explosion but it's happening at the sun every day with a lot of nuclear explosion every day also nuclear in the sun boom 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 boom, boom. so because you like boom la huh? nuclear bomb no need oxygen to get the fire because you you they just get its energy from um, the unstable unstable um atom so like in the just imagine in the sun there's a lot of nuclear happening boom, 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 and got a lot of fire then it will reach to the sun in terms of radioactive and gamma ray and light 
But of course, because you say it's a bomb, my uh, radio anti sarsen. So one day the sun is going to finish. One day you are going to use finish, and um, I don't know. Then all people will die, lah. Huh? The sun will become a red giant. It will almost reach burn all the earth people, and the earth will disappear. All people will will die unless unless you want to go to other planet or what. I don't know. But that is lah. Uh, yeah, I don't know. That's what Elon Musk want to do, is it? He scared people die ma, after the sun dies, so he want to make a rocket to bring people go to other place. Okay. But it's still a long way to go, la, don't worry. Ah. Before nuclear, before the sun die, I think human also die because human like to go for war, ma, war, and then also a lot of people die. People also die with COVID. Before the sun die, human also die. Okay, study 8.1 show the discovery of radioactive substance. So how you know who to know what is a radioactive substance? So in 1895, Wilhelm Conrad Röntgen, a German physicist, discovered X-ray. He has unintentionally taken X-ray photograph of his wife hand. This successfully to receive the first Nobel physics in India. So he discovered the x-ray okay so this is uh, something new that we are also going to do in i mean we do this a lot in hospital right to x-ray and we want to see what happened that's very good however mary curry died in the age of 67 from disease caused by products related to gamma x-ray since the discovery of radium gamma ray emitted by radium has been used in various fields including medicine in cancer treatment Okay, so Marie Curie is also the first person, the person to discover uh, radium and polonium, means uh, a radioactive substance. Uh, he also he also find this one. Uh, in terms of, we say it's X-ray, but this one more find more about uh, the radioactive substance like gamma ray to treat cancer, because you you can use the gamma ray laser to kill the cancer cell of course you kill the cancer cell so you kill the good cell but he died 67 means it's very young because when you do uh, when you do this experiment you will you always get this thing the radioactive substance you always get this thing me it's not good lah huh? because but you are science ma, so you he, he do a lot but you you die early lah, huh? you die early because it is very dangerous and always huh, the, the the thing always exposed to you so um, it's very not healthy la, but I don't know I, I think he know but he, he want to do so so like like that la, huh? you, you you know but you want to do but I, I we as a science people we appreciate uh, what he has done because uh, without you we cannot develop the laser to for hospital treatment so you are the first one to uh, do do thing that contribute to the hospital lah. so maybe can kill help kill like help cancer patient but not not all cancer patient will die ma. some will survive okay then after that we have Henry Becquerel and then Henry Becquerel a friend physicist become the first person to try to discover radioactivity he found radioactive compound uranium and other produce ray that can be that blacken the photographic plate even in the dark so the ray were detected based on ionic property due to this and Henry, Henry Becquerel received a Nobel Prize in physics in 1903 so again they get uh, he is the first person to discover radioactivity so this is very amazing because during this time uh, there's not even like computer you know not really like real computer for them and without computer they can discover many things like atom and radioactive i'm like wow how how you do that uh, even without computer but but yeah this is how they get it after attending a session in the paperwork in rottingen 20 july 1896 becquerel was surprised because his study could not produce X-ray. Hence, Becquerel replaced the material study using uranium compound. So he yeah, using, he discovered by using uranium. Uranium now is to do what? Uranium now is to do bomb. 
you want to make nuclear bomb then you you use uranium or energy then lastly yeah uh, oh uh lastly mary and perry curry mary and a couple and polar cell detect radioactive through the ironing power through the photographic effect so they try to so after that they also learn polonium and radium okay polonium and radium so first we got uranium after that we also discover polonium and radium it's a type of radioactive lah. got a lot of radioactive but these are the few type of radioactive okay yeah so this is the definition of radioactive and radioactive you uh, will produce three radiation three common radiation that we always uh, there's, there's not even four uh, i don't remember there's a four radiation but we know there's a three radiation alpha radiation beta radiation and gamma radiation means there is a radiation that produce uh radioactive radiation like how to say ah uh, something that you cannot see lah so i also don't know how to see because the radioactive is a uh, is uh, something like a uh, energy produced but due to the radioactive decay but you you cannot see it like of course light we can see lah light is one of the example but we can see light but sometimes we cannot see like x-ray when the doctor do and then x-ray you but you but the thing can see ah uh, after the computer do 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 you can see but you cannot see the x-ray gamma ray also you cannot see the laser when you go to hospital not like the star wars laser that choo 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 you can see ah uh, when you go to hospital they do the laser thing 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 you you cannot see one but there is the laser at there or uh, one of the easy example is for example like microwave when you want to cook thing you put the thing inside because they are putting the the ray what what ray is it gamma ray or what la? then the then you get the thing hot there are two things I want as microwave one is the use the heat one that's why I prefer sometimes use the heat one because I, I think microwave not that healthy or the another one is the heat heat homser okay give the thing heat one so it's a different thing so we have um, alpha radiation, beta radiation, and gamma radiation. Thing that we we cannot see lah, huh? We cannot see, but that is there. Okay, so um, so decay of uranium will produce alpha particle. Decay of thuronium two three four, you will get beta particle. Decay of nuclear cobalt, you will get gamma ray. So of course these three thing the most bad thing is this one lah. The most bad is the gamma ray. Okay, because it uh, is not good. Um L alpha ray actually it don't really it's like all of this is a laser that you cannot see, but gamma ray is the worst Jay Pu Ten Kang. Um alpha ray actually is like never mind lah, huh? you go outside also if you alpha ray hit you also, never mind is it's okay. It won't even hit you because it it, it cannot travel that far also and uh, it easily block by you think okay radioactive decay is a random and spontaneous decay where unstable nucleus emit radioactive radiation to become also so it will the thing will continue give the radiation out until it becomes stable so now it's unstable it will continue emit the radiation until it become stable so means i put the stone here let's say like i put something here it will emit the radiation until it becomes stable so for example sometimes it get very fast sometimes the thing is very slow let's look at example the first unit incident by kuri kuri is the person that discovered this the rate of nuclear decay is measured as kuri is 3.7 times 10 power of 10 decay per second the exact unit for bacterial bq is 1 bq is 1 decay over second so um, here didn't say the example 
For example, some substance decay very fast, some substance decay very slow. But I cannot find the example here. Okay, if you decay very fast, then um, it will take maybe even 1000 or 1 million years for that thing to become stable. And very fast one is like 0 0.0000000001 second, then it becomes stable. So it depends on uh, what substance we are using carbon, radon, tronium, uranium. Uh, all this is like the stone. Lah, huh? I, I, I shouldn't use the word stone, but I just want to make it easy for you to understand. Lah, like the stone that got the uh, radioactive substance. Okay, it's a, it's a thing. Lah, huh? Okay, so how we want to calculate it becomes stable? We calculate it by according to half life. Depend on what substance got what half life. So let's say this one is five days. Ah, uh. five days half ipan stable. Ten days, uh, three over four get stable. Okay, and then another half day you get one over eight. Means you get the first one you get one. You get one for the first one. Second one you only get half undecay. Third one, the undecay you get one over four. And get one over eight. And then one over sixteen. One over thirty-two. And so on. So you remember this part lah, more important is the upper part, okay? The and decay because the question will ask you to count. Okay, let's look at the question now. Uh, if the exam asks the question how to count, let's read the question. Protectium 234 decay to uranium 234 with half life of 5.2 hour means that half life of 5.2 hour means that for 5.2 hour it will become half means this this one you see is five day right? means five day it will become half another ten day means you add more five day you become half you add more five day you get fifteen day you get half the ipan the ipan the ipan half half and half again so you get one over eight but for this question it stated that five point two hour which is means that 5.2 hour in order to become ipan half why because you you give radiation give 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 then you then you you become more stable calculate pa from 20.8 so the question asks 20.8 hour so you you try to do like let's say i i draw out uh, let's say 50.8 Let's do like like this one. Let's say ah, uh, this is zero ma. Zero to five point two because half life five point two, five point two, five point two plus five point two. Okay, 5.2 plus 5.2 okay e chia u ten e. Oh hey, now tau ten point four, ten point four plus u ten e plus five point two. You get. 15.6 then you add again 5.2 you get 20.8 so eventually I get this one I get this one already okay now uh, calculate the mass so it starts is 80 gram 80 gram 80 gram 80 gram is the beginning right? 80 gram divided by half 80 gram the ipan is 40 gram. 40 gram the ipan half of 40 gram is 20 gram. 20 gram cut again you get 10 gram. 10 gram you cut again you get 5 gram. So the question asks calculate the mass after 20 hour. So after 20 hour you get 5 gram. So 5 gram is your answer. Yeah, not. So that will be your answer. And maybe later we, we do other questions. Huh? Maybe the next video, then I will give you some questions and you try to do it by yourself. 
Okay, thank you very much. Bye-bye.